I'm doing a reading for the sign of Aries. So Aries, you might be dealing with some burdens right now. You could be experiencing um, some stress-related health concerns. And your life is out of balance. You have too much work. You're going to have to learn to accept help from other people here. But there will be gifts of money for your time and your effort. You might have some new career opportunities coming up. And you might be receiving a loan or paying off some debts. But there needs to be an equal balance of give and take in this situation. Because you're experiencing a, a burden here. You have too much weight on your back. You're carrying too much of a load here. Now, there might be some things going on behind the scenes. And somebody might not be... Uh, honest about how they truly feel about a situation but there are events behind the scenes you're gonna have to release the fears that are holding you back Aries your fears are clouding your judgment and they're stopping you from progressing and doing the things that you need to do in the life that you're supposed to live because you're having fears and you're keeping them bottled in inside and that's not healthy for anybody and this is concerning your happy family life. You will have a contented and rewarding family life. Your emotional and material needs are met. And you will have trustworthy relationships. But there has to be an equal balance of give and take here. You could be focused on your financial stability right now. You could be dealing with the Virgo Taurus Capricorn. Somebody who's very focused on their work. But this is a, su a successful time. Just confidently accept the opportunities you're offered. You could have the Midas touch right now. And this is concerning your happy family life. You might be spending some quiet time alone. You could be dealing with the Virgo here, but you might be spending some quiet time alone and quiet meditation. And you will have spiritual teaching and self-discovery. While you're spending this quiet time alone. Ooh, you feel conflicted, Aries. You don't know what to do. Your brain is scattered, isn't it? So, you might be focusing on your independence right now. And you you will have successful self-employment. And like I said, you're spending quiet time alone. And you're enjoying life's little luxuries. And this is concerning a commitment here. Some of you may be married, but you need to seek out mentors and like-minded friends, Aries. Join some spiritual organizations. Find people that believe in the same things that you do. But your family life is happy and rewarding. So, Aries... could be dealing with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, but you will have relationships here, Aries, that will develop to a new level. You're just going to have to trust your intuition, and you're going to have to learn to take care of yourself and other people. You might want to start treating... No. You will be getting some messages soon. Some of you may be traveling. But there are events here. That are moving at a fast pace. And delays will be over. And there are many things happening at one time here. Some of you may be working through the internet. And you might have a chance to sell yourself through social media. But it's time for you to buckle down and get things done, Aries. And honor the commitments that you made. You do have a guardian angel walking beside you. Yeah, you're focusing on your work environment right now. Your skills work will be rewarded and you could be learning all there is to know about a topic. Some of you are going back to school. Or you could just be studying more about a, a topic that you're interested in. And you need to learn how to be a team player, Aries. 
the power of creativity. You will, you will get recognition for high quality work as long as you start putting the work and the effort in. But you do need to be a team player. Some of you may be collaborating with people at work. And you're going to make things right in a situation. Fair and just decisions will be made. You, you have to do what it is that you know is right. And stand up for the things that you believe in. But your ego is getting in the way. Your fears and your ego is getting in the way. There is a false sense of entrapment here and you're overly focused on material things. You're having negative or fear-based thoughts. You're overly focused on the material things in life and you're hiding behind the material things. And that's not healthy. Who are we dealing with the Gemini, Libra, Aquarius? We have Libra, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and we have Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Okay. You're going to have to learn how to speak your mind with confidence, Aries. You're going to have to seek out professional advice also because your emotional and mental considerations definitely need to be balanced because there is some, some dishonesty here. Somebody was... Lying, cheating, or stealing behind your back. So guess what? There are plans that need revision. There's more going on than meets the eye, and it's poor timing. Could be dealing with another fire sign, but this is something that is putting you at a crossroads here. But there will be an event here, a sudden event, that needs immediate attention. So time is of the essence. You're going to have to think things through carefully before you make a decision. Someone may, re um, someone may reach out to you. There will be news of exciting new endeavor here. You're just going to have to be original. You could be discussing new business ideas with someone else and some of you may be irritated with some of your relatives also. But there is somebody who wants to travel towards you. You may be getting an invitation to a social event. But it seems like somebody here is falling in love. There may be some wedding proposals and a need for you to balance your emotions here. But you will be getting an invitation to a social event because you feel left out in the cold. You may have been ghosted by someone, but there may be fears also surrounding your money. You're going to have to have the wisdom to accept help from other people because there is an uncertain self-employment here that needs attention. You may be getting money, gifts of money for your time and your effort. You will have new career opportunities and... You're going to have, you could be receiving a loan or paying off debts here. But there needs to be an equal balance of give and take in the situation. Because you've been having too much on your back. You do have too much work. You're going to have to accept help from other people because your life is out of balance and it's causing you stress. This stress is demobilizing you, honestly. And there is somebody that wants to offer you something here, something solid. But there is a promising business venture up ahead, and you will have important documents or contracts to, to sign. Yeah, somebody went spying. There's a need for you to get more information, Aries, because there's challenging information. There are delays or changes to your plans, and there will be truth delivered without tact. You could be wanting to travel towards someone, and this is going to give you some public recognition. You're just going to have to learn to self-discipline and get the willpower that you need because an important achievement will be made. And this is going to cause an ending to a situation after being sad and depressed, 
but it will be a job well done. You will have joy, contentment, and gratitude. And this is, this is the path toward enlightenment. Because things are not turning out the way you had hoped. You're not seeing the positive in a situation and you're crying over spilled milk. So you're going to walk away from a situation here because it's caused you a lot of sadness and depression. There is a desire for you to move on and search for something more meaningful. There is some spiritual and emotional growth. Everybody learns a lesson from whatever it is that they're experiencing and you're deciding to walk away and you do have your guard up. But what you need to do is, Aries, is you to, please don't give up. Protect what it is that you've already created and have the courage and believe in yourself. But you will be walking away from a situation that's caused you a lot of sadness and depression. Because you want to find something more emotionally fulfilling. And this will be a successful time. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn energy. You're just going to have to accept the things that are being offered to you because you feel trapped and stuck in a situation. Some of you may have problems with electronics or appliances and like cell phones or um, refrigerators, ovens, microwave stoves, thing, things like that. But you're blinded to the truth of a situation, Aries. You have an illusion of being trapped. And your fears are holding you back because you have a lack of self-confidence and you're scared to take action towards, you know, anything that is helping you expand in your life. You, you know, you, you're going to have to release the harsh judgments that you have on yourself. You're going to have to learn to forgive yourself and learn compassion for not just you, other people also. You need a lot of inner strength to do this also. You could be dealing with a Leo, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, a Cancer. <sighs> but if you do this, Aries, there will be a time of positive change. A situation will suddenly move forward and fortune will be on your side. Okay? All right. Okay. So, Aries, May to June, May to June, Aries, May to June, Ooh. Okay, we have something that's going on in a family room. Coming up soon, toil and labor. Could be concerning a marriage or a commitment. Okay, and this is something you are expecting. This is also involving your community and the people around you. So there is a situation here where Coming up soon in the family room, somebody's going to be putting a lot of hard work and labor into a situation, and this is concerning a marriage or a commitment, but this is something you are expecting, and this is also involving the community and the people around you, but this is on, going to happen on your pathway. It's part of your destiny. This is concerning a house. And somebody, somebody may be receiving a gift at a house or involving a house on your pathway from your community. And this is something you are expecting concerning a marriage or a commitment and somebody put a lot of hard work and labor into the situation on your distant horizons and you'll be getting this in your family room of a house 
And this may cause for you to have second thoughts about a situation. Okay, Aries, you're going to have to release the things and the people and the thoughts that don't serve you so you can move on with your life and stop being stuck and bound to a situation that's making you feel like you cannot basically breathe. Okay, you're going to you're gonna have to release those thoughts and those fears. There is some impartiality here. So somebody is feeding to more than one person than the other. And you're going to have to release the situation here. Because there is impartiality here. But there is also abundance. Someone may need your help, Aries. But you're going to have to learn forgiveness. And release the guilt. Could be from addictions. Somebody might be doing all the work while the other person gets loaded or high or somebody's addictions might be making them feel guilty about a situation you're going to have to learn to forgive yourself and other people because people rely on you for a service or they may need your service and this is bringing you a lot of abundance here but there is impartiality and you're going to have to release the things that don't serve you and as soon as you accept this Accept the things that you cannot change. Things will start to get better. Okay. Aries. May to June. Aries. May to June. Wow. May to June. Aries, you're going to have to accept the fact that sometimes you just can't do everything by yourself. You're only one person. Okay, so we have humility here. Humility. It says, you have developed the loving awareness that you and everyone else are the same, but on different paths. And we have acceptance again. So we have acceptance here. And we have acceptance here. It says, you are ready to release control of situations or people and lovingly embrace the rhythm of life. Um, let's see. Okay. Oh, wait. Now, in love. Aries. Aries. Okay, so we have deception here. Someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship. So, Aries, there is deception going on. You're going to have to pay attention to the red flags because there are signs that are cautioning you. Your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. Okay, so as you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond will deepen. So your love life is ascending to a higher level, level of commitment. You will be spending time in getting to know each other. But you have to pay attention to the red flags because there is some deception going on. And religious factors are a factor in your love life right now. So you and this person might not have the same religious values or morals, but you're going to have to take back control of your life and free yourself from a situation that's been holding you back. You're going to have to keep an open mind. Your soulmate, soulmate may differ 
from your usual type and expectations. So what you need to do is let your friends help you. And there is a strong magnetic attraction here between you and another person. Okay, so let's see. For the person that Aries is dealing with, what messages do we have for Aries? Okay, Aries, the person that you're dealing with is saying that they had wished that they had treated you better. And it says, I know I was a distraction from your pain. So this person knows that they were a distraction from your pain. They wish that they had treated you better and they regret lying to you. This person wants to tell you how they feel. And they do regret lying to you. And they do wish they had treated you better. But they know that they were just a distraction from the pain that you were going through, Aries. But they do want to express to you how they feel. Whatever that means. But they do love you unconditionally. So there's no need for you to worry, Aries. Your fears are... I'm holding you back. Let's see if there's any more messages from the person that Aries is dealing with in May to June. Okay. Okay, Aries. The person that you're dealing with, it's really hard for them to open up. And it says, My family and upbringing are a bigger factor than I realized. So this person's starting to realize that their family and the people that brought them up are a bigger factor in this relationship than they had originally realized. And it's really hard for them to open up. But this person does love you unconditionally. And they do want to tell you how they feel. They do regret lying to you. And they were just trying to distract you from, their, from your pain. But they do wish that they treated you better. So, let's see. Aries. May to June. May to June. Okay. Let's see. Okay, Aries, it's time for you to be assertive because you're going through a recovery period. You could be recovering from, you know, anything emotionally or physically. And in the near future, be assertive because somebody's going through a recovery period. And in the near future, you're going to have to listen to your intuition and it will be the perfect timing. So, good luck, Aries. See y'all in June.